Hello! Today, Bob and I are going to be trying out the GoPro Go Fetch harness for our GoPros. Aren't we, Bob? That's right. Adorama TV presents Capture the Action with Martin Dory. Hello, I'm Martin Dory, and this is Bob the Dog, and you are watching Adorama TV. Now, today, we're going to be testing out the GoPro Go Fetch dog harness. Now, when I first saw this, I couldn't believe it and I had to get one, simply because Bob here likes to take himself off on wonderful clifftop walks and likes to go exploring the beach. And I thought this would be the perfect way to capture just what he sees. So let's go off on a little adventure. But first, we need to put Bob in it. So, the GoPro Go Fetch dog harness comes with two plates. Come here, Bobs. As you can see, we've got a chest plate here and a back plate here. It straps in with elastic straps, which are adjustable, so you can work out just what your dog needs, and it will fit almost any type of dog. Now, the, the chest plate is removable, which also means you can work it with just the back plate if you want to. Now, there you go, he's in. So you can see we've got a couple of options. We've got the, uh, the back plate, which means you can shoot forwards. If you really wanted to, you could shoot backwards, although I can't think why you want to. Um, and then the chest plate, sit down, Bob, sit down, Bob. Okay, he's not gonna sit down. The chest plate will shoot going forwards. Now, your go fetch mount comes with a vertical mount, which means that you can mount the camera on the chest plate looking forwards and it means that you'll get a really great angle looking under Bob's chin as he sniffs about and heads off on his adventures. The other angle on the back plate, this is the best angle, facing forwards. Now the, the harness also comes with a little leash so actually, if you're worried about your dog knocking your camera off, you can attach it. Okay, this is the best angle. The thing about this angle is that you look over the head of the dog, so you'll see exactly what he sees as he runs along. You all right there, Bob? <laughs> he looks like he really hates it. But trust me, when he gets out on his walks, he'll forget he's got it on and you'll soon see him disappear off. Well, the thing I really love about this harness is the fact that you can get these amazing angles that you would never normally see when you're taking your dog for a walk. However, um, you know, you do have to be careful of the fact that dogs are animals and they do move and they will move, you know, as they run. And so your Go Fetch harness isn't the most stable camera platform. And for that reason, I would recommend that you shoot at a high frame rate, so 60 frames a second or 100 frames a second. And you can then slow it down and capture his amazingly graceful runs with his ears flapping beautifully in the wind. Um, and it'll be a really lovely smooth shot. Otherwise, you can tend to get that kind of wobble as they walk. But it's a great thing, and I really love it. It's a fantastic shooting platform, and it'll give you a great angle. However, there is one tip that I'm gonna give you for shooting dogs. Now, this, another GoPro with a roll bar mount, attach it to a stick, throw the stick, and just watch the footage. It is lovely.
That's all for now. Thanks for joining me today on Adder Armour TV. Don't forget, you can pick up some hints and tips at the Adder Armour Learning Centre or go online and check out Adder Armour TV for more great videos. The link is below. So please like, comment or share. And if you want to ask us anything, just get in touch. Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use adoramapix.com.